Hello and welcome to the Tesla Powerwall 3 Masterclass brought to you by Penrith Solar Center. Well, my name is Jake Warner and I am the director of the Penrith Solar Center based in Western Sydney. I'm a licensed electrician and I did my apprenticeship at Endeavor Energy, our local DNSP here in Western Sydney. I have over 10 years installing solar and batteries in Australia. And in 2022, I broke the solar industry by launching our very own training facility. This raised the bar for safety and installation quality for our clients. I and my team are responsible for the installation of well over 1,000 Tesla Powerwall units, dating all the way back to Powerwall 1. And if you wanted some more credibility, then here's what the industry has to say about us. Warwick Johnson's SunWiz rated us number one solar installer of all time. Enphase awarded us four years running Enphase Installer of the Year. Trina Solar, our solar panel manufacturer, awarded us number one residential installer in Australia. Finn Peacock Solar Quotes has awarded us with legendary status. The EU PD Research Awards rated us the number one company in Australia. And what we're all here for, Tesla themselves have rated us not once, but twice with the Installation Excellence Award winners for outstanding customer service, unique solutions, and the highest quality of installation of any Tesla Powerwall installer in Australia. If you're ready to go, strap yourself in while we run through lesson one, the Tesla Powerwall 3 Masterclass. Here is what we're going to cover in the Masterclass. The evolution of the Tesla Powerwall, the specs and features of Powerwall 3, the performance and the blackout protection, the pricing and the value of Powerwall, and the summary, who is Powerwall 3 going to be a good fit for? The evolution of the Tesla Powerwall. The Powerwall 1 was the very first Powerwall that we had in Australia. It was announced in 2014 and installs were flowing end of 2015 and early 2016. The Powerwall 1 was a really dumb battery. It was 6.4 kilowatt hours and the key point of a Powerwall 1 that I want to point out is it always relied on either a solar edge inverter or an SMA Sunny Boy home storage inverter to make the Powerwall work. It didn't actually stand on its own two feet. It always needed a DC coupled hybrid inverter for it to work. Every time we'd commission these batteries, we'd spend hours upon hours. And I would always tell my team to hold faith. This must get better. Q Powerwall 2. Powerwall 2 was announced in 2016 and installs began from 2017. Powerwall 2 is an AC coupled design and it suited any system. This was the best battery available on the market until 2024 when the Powerwall 3 was announced. The highest value and most affordable solar and battery combination ever. Let's talk about the specifications of the Powerwall 3. The storage capacity of the Powerwall 3 is 13.5 kilowatt hours. The Powerwall 3 is actually expandable up to four units for a capacity of 54 kilowatt hours initially. And in the first quarter of 2025, we'll be able to expand on your Powerwall system for up to 216 kilowatt hours for one site. The Powerwall 2 was expandable up to 135 kilowatt hours. So if that wasn't enough, you can now expand to 216 kilowatt hours per site. 
The power output of the Powerwall 3 is 11.04 kilowatt continuous power output. In most cases, it must be programmed for a maximum output of 10 kilowatts due to the DNSP grid limits for inverters in New South Wales across Endeavour Energy Region, Ausgrid and Essential Energy. The charge rating of the Powerwall 3 is 5 kilowatts of power input to charge the battery. The operating temperature of the Powerwall 3 is a very impressive negative 20 degrees Celsius to 50 degrees Celsius and the battery is indoor and outdoor rated, meaning it can be installed in a garage or on the external wall of your home. The dimensions of the Powerwall 3 are really impressive. Tesla worked out that if you take up less wall space, you can fit more storage on your wall and they've done exactly that. The height of the battery is 1,099 millimeters, the width is 609 millimeters, and the depth is 193 millimeters, making the Powerwall 3 one of the most compact batteries for its energy density on the market. The weight of the Powerwall 3 is 130 kilograms, which is 15 kilos heavier than the Powerwall 2. And the mounting of the battery can be floor mounted or wall mounted. At Penrith Solar, we generally recommend to floor mount a battery where possible. 130 kilos hanging off a wall can be a fair amount of weight. So if you're planning on wall mounting your battery, we really wanna make sure that we're choosing a structurally sound and secure wall. Features of the Powerwall 3. Built-in DC inverter with solar input. Powerwall 3's inbuilt inverter converts DC power from your solar into AC electricity that your home can use, with no need for an additional inverter on the wall or microinverters under the panel. Safety. Tesla has opted for lithium ion phosphate or LFP cells in their Tesla Powerwall 3. These cells are known for their stability and safety, offering a lower risk of thermal runaway compared to NMC cells used previously in the Powerwall 2. The LFP cell is also the current cell that they're using in all their new cars. The Tesla app, arguably one of the greatest features of the Powerwall 3. The most powerful and intuitive home energy management software available today. This app will have you an energy expert in an instant. Flood resistant design. Tesla has designed the Powerwall 3 to withstand tough conditions. It can be submerged in water up to 600 millimeters, making it more resilient in areas prone to extreme weather with the possibility of mild flooding. Solar inputs. Powerwall 3 is a solar inverter and battery combination. This is the first time in the world that we've ever seen a battery brought to market that has solar inputs. Aesthetics. Tesla being Tesla have certainly not dropped the ball on aesthetics. It's elegantly engineered, timeless design with a slick glass front cover on both the gateway and the Powerwall, ensuring that the Powerwall 3 will add to the aesthetics and home-like feel of your home and not be a deductor. The performance of the Powerwall 3. Multiple trackers. The Powerwall 3 includes three maximum power point trackers or MPPTs when panels experience shading or are installed on different orientation. These MPPTs adjust and optimize the power output to match the best possible performance. Having three trackers or MPPTs makes the Powerwall 3 also extremely flexible with our design when we add panels onto the Powerwall 3. We can install as little as two panels per tracker or up to 20 panels per tracker. Extremely flexible and yet powerful inputs. The oversizing rule, one of Powerwall 3's greatest advantages. 
Powerwall 3 has an impressive 200% inverter oversizing capacity. This product supports up to 20 kilowatts of solar per Powerwall. And if you were doing a residential install in New South Wales, on three phases, you can have three primary power walls on that site at 30 kilowatts without adding grid protection. This means you can have up to 60 kilowatts of PV on your roof. That is a game changer for residential installs in New South Wales. DC coupled design. The Powerwall 3's DC coupled design reduces energy conversion losses from your panels to the battery, meaning that your round trip efficiency is greater than we've ever seen before, boiling down to more energy for you to use when you need it most. When the battery is charging and discharging, an amount, usually a small amount, of power is lost. That effort causes losses in efficiency. The Powerwall 2, which was AC coupled, had around a 92 to 93% charging efficiency. The Powerwall 3, which is DC coupled, has a 96 to 97% charging efficiency. Protection in blackouts. The Powerwall 3 provides reliable, seamless backup during power outages. The gateway manages the seamless transition between the grid power and stored energy. So you can power through life with peace of mind, knowing that when the grid goes down, your power wall is going to be there to power your home. And with the DC coupled design, having panels directly connected to the battery, it means each and every single day that you're without power, the panels will be able to charge your battery and keep your home going, feeling like it's off grid. Temperature Dictator. The Powerwall 3 will perform in an impressive temperature range of minus 20 degrees to plus 50 degrees Celsius. The Powerwall 3 has the ability to heat up its cells in negative temperatures to ensure that you get the most performance out of your battery when you need it most. Miles of experience. The Tesla Powerwall 3 uses components and features that you would find in any one of those millions of Tesla cars we have on our roads, including heating up for charging and, if, and of course, inverter technology used to power the AC motors in an electric vehicle. And I must admit, when I first seen Powerwall 3 and seen that Tesla wanted to take the inverter technology in-house and bring it into the Powerwall 3, I had some concerns myself and I thought to myself, you're right, Tesla has built millions of inverters and not only are these inverters standing the test of time and outlasting the warranty period and the batteries in Tesla cars, these inverters are also bouncing around on the roads. All day, every day, drivers put their foot down and don't realize the inverter and the work that it's doing behind taking that DC energy from the battery and putting it into the AC motors that run the Tesla cars. So Tesla had me checkmate on that fact too. Pricing of the Tesla Powerwall 3. The pricing. The Tesla Powerwall 3 is priced at $13,600 AUD, including gateway as per the Tesla website. Retrofit pricing, which means when you add a Tesla Powerwall 3 to an existing solar system that you already have on your home. The Powerwall 3 plus gateway plus installation starts at $15,990 AUD. And Powerwall and solar combined. This is for when people don't yet have solar or they may have solar and want to add extra solar to their homes. Installing solar and power wall together from 6.6 .6 kilowatts all the way up to 20 kilowatts will start at $23,990 AUD after relevant federal and state government rebates. Making power wall one of the cheapest and best value home battery options for your home. The Powerwall 3 has a unique proposition for homeowners, and this is that it is the first product in the world that is a solar battery as well as having input for solar panels. 
What this means is it drives install efficiencies. My crews are able to do solar and battery in one day, providing you, the homeowner, with the greatest value for money installation and products that you can possibly put on your home in 2024 and beyond. So who is the Powerwall a good fit for? Single phase homes. The biggest advantage and best experience with Powerwall 3 comes with single phase homes. You can enjoy full home backup and unlock solar production that was never possible before Powerwall 3. On a single phase home now in New South Wales, we are able to put up to 20 kilowatts of PV on the roof. That is something that we've never been able to do before in single phase. Thank you to the Powerwall 3. The Powerwall 3 is also powerful enough to back up any single phase home. So we will be backing up whole homes with the Powerwall 3. New installations for solar and battery. If you're new to solar, Powerwall 3 is one of the best options to wipe out your energy bill once and for all. People who have Tesla products. If you own a Tesla electric vehicle, choosing Powerwall is an absolute no-brainer. The user experience is beautiful and seamlessly connects your home with your car with one swipe of a finger. Tesla have features like charge from sunlight and the user experience on the Tesla app is one of the greatest application experiences that I've personally ever experienced in my life. The Tesla app integrates into my life on a day-to-day -day basis, whether I'm checking the charge capacity of my car and how many kilometers I have to drive, or if I'm checking the performance of my solar system and batteries throughout the day for nothing else other than bragging rights. Blackout protection. If you live in an area prone to a lot of blackouts, this battery can output up to 10 kilowatts of continuous power and the ease of adding additional storage over time mean that you'll be able to power through any grid outage that comes your way. Your neighbors will be looking at you as they're lighting their candles, thinking how do they still have lights, internet, and they've still got music playing. You'll be none the wiser as you check your Tesla app to see how many hours you've been living off grid for. It's such an incredible feeling. Growing energy needs. Expand your Tesla Powerwall lineup as your family's energy needs increase with the adoption of electric vehicles and home electrification. The great advantage of Powerwall is that you can add more units on in the future. So if you buy solar and storage for today and in the future you have kids or buy an electric vehicle, it is so simple to continue adding more solar or more storage to your existing Tesla suite. I hope you've enjoyed this lesson of the Tesla Powerwall 3 Masterclass. Next up, join me for single phase versus three phase with the Tesla Powerwall 3. You might be surprised which one I consider to be the better experience. We'll see you on the next one.